Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Red Live Dream Horses, and today it is finally spring. Well, it has been for quite a few days now, but um, it's spring, and I thought it'd be a great idea to do a spring clean. We're also going to do a little bit of a renovation, and by spring clean, I mean like really get into some good detail. So we're going to be like dusting down all the barns and stuff like that. So let's get started. So the first thing I am going to do to start cleaning up is I'm going to put this rake in the arena and like smooth it out because it is really good. So I'm going to get smooth out the outdoor arena. So in the arena, if you can see, right over there is a treat bag. So let's get that. So we're going to grab this treat bag. It's a little bit sandy, but... Grab the treat bag, put it out of the arena and start smoothing. So let's start smoothing. So it makes a really nice like detail thing and it makes like a nice pattern and I really like it. And I hope you guys, guys can kind of see the sort of wavy pattern that it makes. But it makes a really nice pattern and it's more, it's sort of like a smoothing out pattern for arenas. So... Then I'm going to leave the rake like that. I'm not sure if you can see the um, lines, but there is lines in real life. But it's not really showing on camera. Now that that's done, let's start picking up some like tack and things. So I found these random jumping boots and travel boots. So I'm going to put them in some like storage containers or some like... I don't know, storage, the storage or tack room. So let's go do that. Okay, so here I found like a little section where you can put little um, stuff. So I found some like hood collars. I'm going to actually put them on some hooks. But these jumping boots, they can go in. And they're inside there. I think I lost the blue one. Oh, there it is. There you go. And over here we'll hang up the halters. Since we're over here, I'm going to fix this too. I think I knocked this the other day while I was playing in here. And that's probably why everything's fallen. And also my little cat Whiskers has fallen from her cat scratcher. So we need to put her back in her position. There we go. So there's a lot that needs to be like hanged up and stuff, but this halter that I made um is broken, so I don't know how I'm gonna like hook it up or anything. It's not really staying because the part with the clip on it has like fallen off, so I'm just gonna have to like put that like that. Oh, it didn't really stay, but that's good enough. <laughs> Okay, I am feeling generous, so I'm going to start, like, putting my, like, rugs away because certain horses still need their rugs in the spring, but most of the horses don't need their rugs as much. They need their fly rugs, but... Wait, so over here we have a stand. So, like, this is where we're going to put the rugs. So you just, like, have to unclip all the buttons and things, and then you sort of just, like, slide it on like that. And then... That one like that. Okay, let's see if there's any other rugs just hanging around. So I found more tack, like random tack on the um ground, like a lunging set and stuff. Okay, this is getting worse and worse because there's actually a person in the paddock now. So let's take her out. I'm also going to stand this horse up and take his yoke off because he's a gelding. And also he doesn't have sensitive skin like some of my other horses. And this one can just go on here too. Now it's more of the little things that we just have to fix up. And now I need to put this bridle away. I think this looks like empty, so we'll put it on here. 
So I'm going to put um, Bella in her stall and I've also got this maid feed. So we'll give that in her stall. So guys, we're nearly getting up to the part where we get to dust down some barns and renovate the um, paddocks. So guys, now it's time for renovation, so let's get started. Um, I know I kind of said this at the start, but we're now getting started with the actual like renovation of the paddocks. So I'm pretty happy with my stallions and mares and ponies, but I'm not really happy about this setup here. So I'm not quite sure what we can do, but I think we could go something... Oh, I don't really quite sure about what I'm going to do but I think I might move it like that something like that or maybe I might like turn this so that we still have like that and then oh my goodness okay so then we still cut off that cow and we still have a little paddock for the falls so, sort of like that. So this is what I have so far for the foals paddock. So we're just going to move these foals into the here. I know it's a really awkward sort of shape, but, like, I kind of like it because it's, like, different, you know? I'm going to move this hay bale, too, into this pasture. And duh. then I'm going to um, do, like, this. I know this is really awkward, but I kind of like it. Mm, actually, setup is quite weird. Um, it's different. It blocks off the cow still, but I don't. I'm not quite sure about this. Okay, here's how it's gonna work. Like this video if you think we should keep it like this. Subscribe if you think we should put it back to the way it is and then in my next video i see what got most and then i'll switch it to or keep it to what it was or what it is so the last of all things we're going to be doing some dusting off i'm going to be dusting off my plastic barns because my cardboard barns aren't that dusty to be honest so let's get started so right now i'm going to get so guys, now I'm walking and I'm going to get a towel or cloth to go to dust off my barns. So guys, I just grabbed um, a cloth from the kitchen. This is a duster and we're going to go dust my barns. So the first barn we're going to dust is my little mini barn. So this one is my little mini um shelter thingy i only like just got this a couple um like three months ago so it's not awfully awfully dusty but you know we're still gonna give it a dust just um for spring clean i mean it's not really dusty my red barn is my most dustiest barn but yeah this is quite clean i think my shelter is a little bit more dusty this one is a little um this one's like a lot dustier it's like um and it's also older but it's not that dusty it's just dusty but it's not the dustiest thing but it's still dusty and it's one of the things that i've had most of like so now we're gonna put the um shelter oops we need to put it on the right way so this needs to this part is at the front the little part with the um clip and horseshoe this part and with the rosettes so that just there you go so now it's time for the main pretty much part well not really um my red barn is more important but we're just gonna clean this one so let's get started so here we go so I'm just trying to get into like the little dusty little crannies. So there's like lots of little spots where it's um quite dusty. And I'm going to lift up these so that we can dust on the inside. I don't know. I am really just getting serious in these. 
parts and then open these ones just so they look like clean don't think it made quite a difference but then we do the outside of them okay it looks quite decent um, and make sure when you're doing this you're not using a tape towel because I just don't recommend doing that so I am using a actual dust cloth dust cloth sorry and it's really working quite well all right I think that's done so it's a little show look at how clean that is you can look straight through it and then you just pull up it right on top okay it's time for the really hard part now um the red bond so i'm gonna go up that and we'll get started so i'm gonna get rid of this um gilding right here and we're gonna put the stable in this gilding's paddock so that i can have it right in front of me bye bye gilding here comes the red barn oh my goodness it doesn't even fit in the paddock come on and bolt made a really rough way to here here's my gelding oh there's the cloth <laughs> so we'll put the geldings there and we're gonna get started dust all right let's start um dusting oh my goodness it looks so different already there's like so much dust on here now oh my goodness i haven't dust my bars in a long time well okay this is getting really dusty I don't think I should be doing this in my um on my grass, but you know we are. Oh my goodness, the camera was about to fall then. It was so shaky. <laughs> okay, there we go. That's a bit better. Oh my goodness, this barn has not been dusted and clean in such a long time. Let's turn it around. Have a little. Oh, the camera nearly fell again. Um, look at the back. It's just windows. Oh my goodness, camera, don't fall on me, please. Okay, so this barn's pretty clean. I mean, I'm trying to get into all the little nooks and crannies, like in between these stable doors, but it's really hard. I don't think opening them will make make it easier, though. Mm, that didn't really help. But, you know, um, I'm going to try this side now, because that side actually looks cleaner than this side on the door. What did I even do to the other this side? To the other side, I mean. Wow, this looks a lot cleaner than um, how it looked before. All right, that just snapped out of place. But I think, wait, yeah, it still clicks in. Yeah, there we go. All right. So, oh my goodness, this red barn is officially nice and clean. You can see the little name plates and that is very nice it's not dusty anymore yay so guys i hope you guys like this video if you did make sure you hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss out on my next video bye